Today we're going to learn about nets. A net is a flat shape. They're all the ones without the colour. And when they're rolled out, it's an open flat. And they're all 2D shapes joined together. But when they're folded back up and joined together with their corner and corners and edges, they become 3D shapes. Let's have a look at the first one to see if we can look and find what net out of these three make a cube. If you look over here, we have two circles and we have a big rectangle. Wonder if we join all that up, get some sticky tape or some glue and wonder if that will become a cube. No, I don't think so. If we look over here, we've got triangles, one, two, three, four, and we have a square on the base. If we join all those triangles up to a vertex, I wonder what kind of 3D shape that would be. But I think it's pretty obvious. This one over here, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six squares. If we join all those squares and roll it up, yep. That's the net. This is the net. Folded back up becomes a 3D shape. Okay, let's go over here. This 3D shape is our cylinder. If we roll this together and we put the circle joined, will that make a cylinder? No, because a cylinder needs two circles as the basis. Over here, we've got one circle here, one circle here. If we roll this big tri rectangle sorry, together, we join it, it will become a cylinder. So that is the net to make a cylinder. Okay, down here. This is a cuboid, our 3D shape here. Cuboids do not have triangles, so that one's out. If we join this one together, it's a little bit like this, the cube, isn't it? That is definitely going to be our net for the cuboid. Not this one, because cuboids do not have uh, triangles. All right, last one. If we look at this 3D shape, it's got a square base here. It's got triangles joined up. We know it's a square base pyramid. This is pretty easy, isn't it? If we look here, here is a square. There is the triangles. We join it together. The net here is a square-based pyramid.